Hi there, thank you for clicking into this video to watch it. My name is Sugar and I'm an Abuja YouTuber based right here in the capital city of Nigeria. Consider hitting the subscribe button below and turning on the bell notification so that YouTube gets to notify you whenever a new video comes up right on this channel. In today's video, we are going to be talking about the tea tree foaming cleanser. Now we know that tea tree oil is one of the essential ingredients to look out for whenever you're looking for a product, okay, especially gentle products that help to cater to your skincare concern as regards oily skin, as regards, you know, acne prone skin. Tea tree oil has been one of those magical ingredients and trust me my darlings, this particular one, I got it. So this review is going to be a live review. Yes, I have the empty container. You can see I literally just used the last one, the very last one this morning. Does this product work? what does it promise here on the body it says that this foaming face wash with tea tree and peppermint oil has been specially formulated to help cleanse and refresh your skin leaving it feeling clean smooth and refreshed the honest truth is that this particular cleanser did not say that it is going to take care of your acne or that it is going to take care of you know your oily skin no what it said is that it is going to leave your skin feeling clean smooth and fresh its job is to cleanse and to refresh your skin but of course like i mean it contains tea tree oil so it means that there is every tendency for it to help to reduce inflammation on your face how did that work out for me i'm going to be letting you in on all of that but one of the first things i want you to know is that this brand is actually an international brand it was produced in the uk okay formulated in the uk produced in prc now what are the things that this foaming cleanser does for you it helps to keep your face feeling clean and refreshed it also helps to remove makeup if you are looking for a good makeup remover you necessarily don't want to use you know face wipes and you're thinking of double cleansing it's also a form of double, double cleansing okay so once you come back even if you have heavy makeup on you can go in with this cleanser immediately it's a foaming cleanser lather on your hand apply on your face and you will literally see all the makeup coming off your hand immediately i give it to them okay so it's an excellent makeup remover it unclogs your pores and removes excess oil and dirt from your skin does it do all of this I'm going to give it to it okay yes i'm going to give it to it just before we go into talking about you know my personal experience with this particular foaming cleanser what are the major ingredients of the foaming cleanser i mean you can already tell from the beginning of the video that i started talking okay aside from every other ingredient that was used to formulate this particular product the two key ingredients in this particular foaming cleanser is the tea tree oil and the peppermint oil now the tea tree oil is essentially formulated to help reduce inflammation on your face to help hydrate your skin even if it can be drying at time, so you want to go heavy on a good face moisturizer when you are using it or a good face serum, okay? Whichever you go into first, as soon as you're done using this, okay? I usually go in with my vitamin C serum right immediately, okay? To, keep, to just give me that glow and that way I am sure that my skin is not drying out excessively, especially because I use it morning and night. I was literally using it as my regular face cleanser, okay? Like the regular soap for my face is what I use. I use it to take off my makeup and then I go in with it again, double cleansing with it, yes. Now the peppermint oil in this formulation also contains antiseptic and antibacterial properties. And now I will tell you that this is one of the reasons why this thing did not work for me or work as expected because I mean from what you can already tell by watching this video, everything that this particular brand promised to do, it's actually delivered on it for my face. I already said I was having the expectation that it was going to help me control acne, but there was nowhere on this container where it says or where the brand promises that this is going to help you treat your acne. Yes, it contains treaty oil and it's supposed to help you reduce inflammation, but did it do any of that? Did it really do using anything? this for the now? Here is my personal experience using this particular foaming cleanser. I've been using this foaming cleanser for the past approximately five to six weeks. And you guys, in the first week when I started using this foaming cleanser, I fell in love, yes, because I, you know, I had that sensation of, you know, that tingly peppermint feeling that you have mint on your face. It felt so cool. It had this cooling effect on my face. And I saw how squeaky clean my face was. I didn't have to rub too much. Just, you know, gently massage the foam into my face and wash off. And I discovered that whenever I double cleanse with it, like after washing the first time, I, I you know, wash my face with water and I go in again with the foaming cleanser. It leaves my face looking even cleaner and fresher, especially when I use a lot of makeup during the day, okay? Coming back at night and double cleansing with this did amazing for my skin, I'm going to tell you. It helped to keep my skin clean, but it did not treat my acne. It did not reduce my inflammation. Any acne I had, I still had them. If there were rashes on my face, I still had the rashes, okay? I mean, if this thing was working, you guys, every day I wake up with... A new you guys look at it it began to feel like this was literally like the regular soap i usually use on my body that i use on my face because i mean 
using my lemon fresh body wash on my face actually cleared my face and put my inflammations or acne or breakout in check as against this the only thing this particular foaming cleanser did was to keep my face fresh and clean that i can tell you whenever i finish using it i always feel very clean even if i don't take my bath and i just wash my face okay with this i always feel very clean the sensation of oh your skin is looking clean and all of that was really amazing and i'm glad for that okay you guys but i will say one thing that it helps to also take away dullness from my skin sort of even if i was using vitamin c serum and vitamin c serum is going to brighten your dull skin whether you like it or not yes but this also contributed to it okay in fact at the time i was using my vitamin c serum morning and night so you can imagine how you know bright my skin especially the skin on my face began to be it almost began to look like i was bleaching and i wasn't okay so what i did was to tune down on how on the frequency at which i use the vitamin c serum i started to use it only at night and honestly i prefer to use vitamin c serums at night i think it works better it works it's more safer there is no fear of sunburn okay the rays of the sun tampering with the vitamin c serum on your face and then washing or cleansing your face with this particular one did it help keep my the oil on my face in check i'm not sure because you guys in the course of using this particular foaming cleanser i produce more oil during the day even when i use makeup even when i use powder okay like i would always say when i was using just my lemon french body wash like the body wash i use shower gel i use for my body using it on my face i would go out have makeup on foundation and everything and i would literally step out of the house and come back at the end of the day okay step out in the morning come back in the evening and my makeup is intact there's no oil on my face i don't have to dab oil on my face but this one see as soon as i'm done watching this video i'll have to either reapply my powder or dab my face okay so that the oil can go in a bit it did not control oil for me. I don't know if it even made my face to start producing excess oil. The reason I cannot tell is it because I was using it twice a day. But here it says daily use. And I mean daily use means you can use it in the morning and you can use it in the evening. But you guys, that is my experience with this particular foaming cleanser. Am I going to get it again? No, I am not. But if you are somebody who does not have or is not experiencing breakout already okay you have a smooth skin there are no pimples or acne on your face but you have an oily skin and you just want to keep your oily skin in check a bit then i would advise that you go for this this is just a very simple face cleanser that helps to keep your skin clean and fresh every day and i mean if you can keep your skin clean and fresh okay with makeup without makeup I mean, who is acne or what is acne? What has acne got on you, my darlings? <laughs> but if you have already existing acne that you are trying to treat or inflammations or pimples that you want to take care of, that you want to manage, this is not the product for you. Please do not use it to treat acne or to manage acne. Yes, it will not clear your acne. It will not reduce the inflammation on you guys. It will not. It will only keep your face clean and fresh and smooth, okay? yes you guys have you used this foaming cleanser before let me know in the comment section below are there other foaming cleansers that you want us to try out let me also know in the comment section below are there also other cleansers or creams or tuners or moisturizers that you would like us to review here on this channel please drop it in the comment section below and i will be getting onto it immediately and that brings me to the end of this video did you find this video helpful in any way let me know in the comment section below please do not forget to like this video hit the subscribe button turn on the bell notification so that youtube notifies you whenever a new video comes up on this channel and also most importantly help us share out this video please share out the video to your whatsapp status to your facebook timeline to your twitter if you're on twitter share it to your insta story if you're on instagram until i come away next time in my very next pretty video stay lifted stay blessed stay inspired and don't you ever forget that sugar loves you hey.